Hi, I'm Anthony at JJ Cookson. I'm going to be showing you around this delivery mileage 2008 Allure Premium and what main features come along with it. So you can see you've got your alloy wheels, you've got the chrome finish which comes underneath the windows and around the top of the rear one. So you'll see we've also got the rear tinted windows as well which are very nice. If you come around the back, as you can see you've got your rear parking sensors across the bottom of the rear bumper. Let me show you the boot size quick. So as you can see, it is a good boot size. It does also have a flat bottom as well, which makes it very easy for you to get things in and out of the boot, which is a very good feature. I'll show you the interior design. Come around the front, as you can see, you've got your fog lights with the cream finish around them, which are very useful. I'm going to show you what features we have on the inside now. So, the first thing you can see on the touchscreen is you've got your digital radio, which is very good because it means you can listen to a wider range of radio stations. It does also come with Bluetooth. So if you wanted to listen to your own music, you do also have that option as well. Press menu. As you can see, you get your radio from pressing the top left button. It does also come with sat nav, as you can see, which is very good. If you come down, you can see we've got climate control. So you can change the temperature of the driver's side. You can also do the same for the passenger side as well. Here, you can see this is where you want the air to be blowing. And these two buttons are your fan power. So. You turn it down by pressing that button, turn it up by pressing the opposite one. As you can see, you've got your aircon as well. A bit lower down, as you can see, you've got your USB slot on the right. It's very good because it means it gives you access to Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, and it does also mean you can charge your phone while you're driving. On the left, you have a cigarette charging socket as well, which is also very useful. See, so you've got two drink holders, and you've also got space for your phone and any other items you might want to put in there as well. Here we've got your grip control, so if you're driving on tarmac you'd have it on that setting, if you're on snow you can have it on that setting, if you're on mud, sand, and if you want to turn it off you can also do that as well. If you look up, as you can see we do have a glass roof as well, which is a very nice feature. You can close the electric blind if you don't want the glass roof open, and all you have to do is just push this button down, and as you can hear it's just coming over now, to reopen it. Simply just do the opposite, just pull it back up again. Let's quickly switch the engine on. Put the car into reverse. As you can see, you, you do have a reversing camera, so you can clearly see what's behind you when you're reversing, which is very good. It makes it much easier for manoeuvres such as parking up, for example. Thank you for watching. If you need any further information, give us a call or drop us an email.